Yes. How should I manage my hair in this? You don't. You don't. That's yeah. why Look you bring, at my hair. That's why you bring hair ties, babe. Look at the state of this. <laughs> Yeah, you did. I like. I thought you were way ahead of me. So we are this. I don't know either. Um. But this is the first stop on the uh, Dublin trip. Is it a cutie? <laughs> it does though. Looks like the head is missing. Yeah. That is cute. It looks like it's. So the whole concept of this is kind of weirding me out a little bit. <coughs> Not to say that like, I understand why they do what they do, but it's bizarre to me that they would have a beautiful cemetery like this with all these amazing graves and then they would decide to open an Instagram account for such a thing and have a shop. Like right next to it. I don't know how I feel about that, honestly. But I mean, then again, there's lots of businesses that make perfectly good money out of the dead, I guess. But when all that I said is done, it's beautiful. Sandra. Rock on, Sandra. <laughs> Glass Nevin. Glass Nevin is called. Not to be sold. What? Glass Nevin graveyard in Ireland. This reminds me of the, um, the place we were last time. What's it called? Kind of, but a lot bigger. Oh, uh, yeah. Highgate Cemetery. Highgate Cemetery, yeah, it, it does, but this is so much, so much bigger. And I think older. I'm not surprised if this was one of the biggest cemeteries in Europe, I'm actually not sure. Yeah, you can see the coffins in there. Oh, really? Oh, wow. There's two coffins in there. It's free, yeah. I think. It's too small, I can't see anything. <laughs> <laughs> They're not told enough. <laughs> Good thing, that's clear. Don't know if your camera will see it or not. I don't know if it's. Just can you zoom? 
No, it's just taking the... Right well, maybe if I put this on that vision. And the roof, the walls come down as well. The back looks at it just to the right, and really, you see two bombs. Tombs, I guess. Outside, outside. 